Hey everybody, Ian from Novel Music here, and in this video we're going to take a look at the changes made to Travelog in version 1.1. Navigation is now a little bit faster. On the top of the uh, XY pad here you see we can easily jump to the LFO tab, and on the side now is where we find our presets. Let's get some sound going here. Alright, I like that. Now I'm going to save that. I'm going to copy that preset and put it into slot 2 so I can make some changes to it. Now I'll save that. And you can see now I can smoothly interpolate between preset slot 1 and preset slot 2. And it's a lot easier now with this new panel. Over on the voices control panel, we now have individual settings for the lock. So by default, all four voices are set to global, which means they'll read from whatever's happening here on the main lock. However, let's say in the of voice A, I can bring this to its own individual setting. So let's turn it off, meaning that voices B, C, and D will repeat the same thing over and over again here based on the lock and the uh, reset setting here. But voice A is going to spin out a constant set of variations without repetition. I'll save that. And uh, these, this new setting responds to the interpolation. You can see there it's sliding back to the default global. Over on the LFO menu, we have a new shape, binary noise, bin, which um, instead of being any value between 0 and 1 is either 0 or 1, but with a complete random chance of either happening. We also have for the square wave now pulse width, control over the pulse width, so let me speed this up a little. So you can see here it's going every two quarter notes. I can change the pulse width to make it more narrow. You can see that it's much smaller, and I can make it much larger. Let's try 85% there. So it gives you a little more control over the modulations. And those are the changes for Travelog 1.1. I hope you'll enjoy using this device, and it is available now at novelmusic.org. Thanks for checking this video out. Please subscribe and stay tuned for the next video.